I think that people need to do it for their own safety. State Representative Bill Deacon wasn't always for changing any seatbelt laws. I was like a lot of people who call me right now and say, you know, keep the government out of it. We don't need people telling us what to do. That all changed after four family members crashed into an Amtrak train. Took the front end completely off the car, rolled them over in a ditch, and nobody was hurt. For the past couple of years, he started voting for the new bill. He filed for this one last week. Deacon says he needs at least 82 votes of approval in order to make the bill a primary traffic law, making signs like these more than just a polite request. Currently, the state claims wearing a seatbelt as a secondary law. A law enforcement officer cannot give you a ticket specifically for wearing your seatbelt. You must have been stopped for another reason. This is the last time Deacon will file for the bill. He says he knows of only 70 people who will vote for it, but remains confident. Until then, Bill waits. Macrocheski, KMU8 News, Jefferson City.